today's video or the title of this video is see it in your mind first that's the title of this video see it in your mind first and did that just follow me did that just follow me how cool is that or did the thing just move i think the camera just moved <laughs> anyway is that recording it is too uh so see it in your mind first this is something that I learned from Tony Robbins, uh, and and it's so, something really, really powerful that that I learned. And what it is is this: is that I think sometimes when we have a goal and we're trying to achieve something, or we're trying to we're trying to achieve something that day, I think it's important that we actually see it in our mind first because. If, we're, if our body's doing something but we're, our brain is not sure what's going on, well now we have a mind-body disconnect. But if we see it in our mind first, what, whatever the mind knows, when the mind knows exactly what to do, the body follows. So that's what actually Tony Robbins would do with, with his coaches, right? with coaching tennis players and a lot of other different players out there. That's what he'd do, he would, actually, he would actually coach them in a way of seeing it in their mind first and then what he would do is then something that the action would follow, right? The action would follow as in, he, they would, uh, um, yeah, the, the body would follow. And, uh, and I, I first got, I first was aware of this through, uh, I saw an interview with uh, Tony Robbins and, and a couple of marketing millionaire, men, marketing sort of mentors that I look up to as well too. And he said, do this here, do this here. He said, he said, stand up. So you got him to stand up and he said, point the finger. So you got the point the finger, he said, turn around and see how far you can go. So that's, that's, how, far, that's how far I can go without doing anything right now, right? So back over there somewhere. So, so from here and just point it over there, right? So that, that's all I want you to do, it's just do that. So see how far you can turn without, without hurting yourself or pushing yourself or anything like that. He said, now close your eyes. He said, all right, before you didn't see it in your mind, now I want to see it in your mind. See yourself and see yourself turning around and see yourself even going further the next time and see yourself going even further the next time and see yourself going all the way around see it's like a big game you know it's gone round and round and round and round. it's playful it's just gone round and round and round and round and round he goes right now open your eyes put it there you know and now i actually went i went from over there right to just there so you can see that i just i, I went that extra further I went that extra, f I, 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 my body performed that extra more by seeing it in my mind first. And he said that, that this is, this is what, this is what they do. He said, and he was also telling, a, he was also telling a, a, a study that they actually did. It was actually a true, a true study. He said that there was two teams. There was team A and there was team B. Now these were basketball teams. Both team A, team B were very similar in skill sets, okay? Three throwing, three pointers, uh, you know, speed, agility, all that sort of stuff, right? Very, very similar. So what they did is they actually went for a three-pointer comp three competition. So team A, team A over here, what they did is they just practiced, right? P for practice. They just practiced free throw and they kept practicing, they kept practicing, they kept practicing, they kept practicing, right? And so that's what they do, they kept practicing free throws. But then team B, what they did is that they practiced P for practice, but they V for visualized as well too. Can you see that? Just double checking my recording here. V for visualized, there we go, cool. So, V for visualized, so they did that. And they did that for a period of many weeks or I think a month or something like that. So anyway, what, what ended up happening, come game day, who do you think won the three, it was, it was a three-pointer competition. Who do you think won the three, who do you think won? Team A, who just did the practicing, or team B, who did the practicing and the visualizing? Well, you probably know the answer from the, from the exercise that I just did with you, right? It was team B. So, see it in your mind first. If you're trying to achieve something that day or trying to do something that day, just stop for five minutes, see it in your mind, see it done, visualize it, and your body will go there, right? Um, so, that's what I wanted to talk about, guys, is see it in your mind first. Hope you enjoyed this video, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Hey, it's John Hal here again. If you like this video, then hit that like button and share this video with your friends to help them out as well. I really appreciate you sharing this video around with your friends and family. If you did like this video, then you're really going to like my brand new book called The Flow of Success. Tap into the top 19 powerful universal laws to succeed in every area of your life faster and easier than ever before. 
As I record this video, I'm doing a special launch price, so click on the book image, or there's a link in the description as well to check it out, to check the actual book out as, as well on Amazon. Remember, success can be yours if you go claim it, so step up, take massive action, and face your fears today.